So yesterday morning around 8.30 a.m. I came into my kitchen and I was going to film a what I ate today video. I came over to the counter and I was about to pour myself a glass of juice when I saw ants and I flipped out. I hate bugs and I especially hate bugs in my house and if there's one place in my house that I hate bugs more than any other place, it's my kitchen. Right away, I put the juice away and I started cleaning everything off of my counter. I found, I don't know, maybe 20 or 30 ants and they were pretty much based around this area you see here, around my sink and around the window. And I just started killing as many ants as I could find, started throwing things in the dishwasher, started throwing things away. I mean, I didn't really have a lot of stuff on the counter to begin with. I had some uh, dishes draining. I had a few dishes in the sink. Um, and then I had just some stuff that I picked up at the supermarket on top of the counter. But thankfully, those were all sealed jars and sealed packages. Um, so what happened was I tracked the source of the ants down to this window and it looked like they were coming from this top corner of the window because every time I thought I'd killed all the ants I would see maybe another one or two walking down from this top corner of the window so I knew I would have to do something to make sure that the ants don't come back because I had previous ant experience um, when I lived in a townhouse, I don't know, maybe five, six, seven years ago, I know what didn't work. When people say use vinegar and that will get rid of ants, I knew that that did not work for me. Other people say use cinnamon or cayenne pepper and that didn't work for me. Other people have said use coffee or coffee grounds and that did not work for me. This is what worked for me. I call it ant death spray. And here's how I made it. First thing I did was I bought this spray bottle from the Dollar Tree. Then I also purchased a bottle of white vinegar from the Dollar Tree. I added about 20 drops of peppermint essential oil. And I added about 11 drops of eucalyptus essential oil. I then shook everything up. And what I did was I sprayed down the entire window with this spray. Um, I sprayed my counters down with this spray. Um, after I sprayed it on the counters, I then uh, wiped it up with a paper towel. I did spray it on the window where it looked like the ants were coming in. I did not wipe that down. I wanted it to dry there. I then cleaned my entire kitchen with this ant death spray and it works surprisingly well on laminate floors. I used it with a dry Swiffer and it made my uh, kitchen floors really clean. In fact, I really like it. Now I know people are going to say don't use acids on granite, like it's bad for the granite. And while I probably agree with that, um, if you use it on a daily basis, for something like this, which is not done on a daily basis, but is more for emergencies like ants getting in, um, then I don't mind putting some acid on my granite. I don't think um, using it for a day or even a few days is going to be that detrimental to it. However, um, if you're all freaked out about that, you could always replace it with, I don't know, maybe water or, or maybe like witch hazel or something like that. I don't know if it's going to work as well. Um, I don't know if it's the combination of these three that work really well, but so far today I have not seen one ant anywhere. And if you're worried about everything smelling like vinegar, I hate using plain vinegar um, as a cleaning solution just because I don't like the smell of it. But when you mix in the peppermint oil and the eucalyptus oil, it makes it smell so much better. It actually gives it kind of like a, uh, like a spicy aroma, which I don't mind nearly as much. To me, it just smells like herbally clean. 
So basically, I thought I would share with you what worked for me for getting rid of these ants. So far, I have not seen any ants in my kitchen since spraying everything down with this ant death spray. I should say that also, I went to the outside of my house and um, I had a can of Raid. I sprayed the outside of the window with the can of Raid. And then a few hours later, when I got home, I took out my uh, ortho home defense and I sprayed the window with that. I also sprayed along the foundation of the house, like um, under the siding area in case they were crawling up from the ground. I don't mind chemicals outside of my house nearly as much as I mind them inside of my house, especially in my kitchen. Um, today, to be sure, I also sprayed more of this Ant Death um, outside of the window. Honestly, I did not know how well this spray would work for me when I put it together yesterday. I knew what had not worked for me in the past um, from trial and error. So based on deduction, I thought that this would be a more potent mixture than stuff I've tried. And knock on wood, thankfully, so far it has been. Um, so I thought I would share it with you. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope it was helpful. If it was, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel if you'd like me to post more videos. Thanks for watching again and have a great day. Bye.